Hello everyone and welcome once again to MJ's Maths and Stats. That's MJ Magic Studio to you. There are six employees in a firm. Mr. White, Mr. Black, Mrs. Coffee, Mr. Kelly, Miss Anshaw, and Miss Ankita. The work station they occupy are the work station they occupy are the work station they occupy are manager, assistant manager, stenographer, cashier, clerk, and teller. Not necessarily in the given order, obviously. Okay. Now I will give you some information. With help of that information, you need to try to locate who is occupying which work station. Okay, first information. Mr. Black is bachelor. Next, Mr. White is twenty-two years old. Next, assistant manager is manager's grandson. Next, Mr. Kelly is manager's neighbor. Cashier is stenographer's son-in-law. And the last one, Ankita is teller's stepsister. With the help of this information, you have got three minutes. Try to locate who is appointed at which position in the firm. Start. The easiest way to solve these kind of questions, or you pura solve karne mein, agar aap apni copy mein solve karoge, so you won't take more than two two and a half. Usse jada nahi lagta. It all depends upon your speed, how quickly you are doing. I'll go slowly, but you will make no notes. But see what we are doing. Learn the method, and then you can apply this method for any kind of in these kind of things. Whether yahan par kitne variables hain? Six variables hain. गलत यहां पर सिर्फ दो वेरिएबल एक है नाम और एक है पोजीशन मेंबर सिक्स है पोजीशन सिक्स है दिस इज द बेस्ट थिंग देयर आर टू वेरिएबल नेम एंड पोजीशन एंड ऑल काउंट्स आर सेम मतलब सिक्स नेम्स सिक्स वेरिएबल यू कैन बिल्ड अ स्क्वायर सिक्स बाय सिक्स इट सिंपली मींस दैट वन नेम विल गो विद वन पोजीशन और वन पोजीशन विल गो विद वन नेम ये सबसे बेस्ट है और सबसे इजीएस्ट ऑफ द ग्रेड मानेंज ओके यू कैन हैव दिस सिक्स इंटू सिक्स मैनेजर असिस्टेंट मैनेजर कैशियर स्टेनोग्राफर क्लर्क एंड टेलर यू हैव गॉट मिस्टर व्हाइट मिस्टर ब्लैक मिसेस कॉफी मिस्टर कैली मिस अंशो एंड मिस अंकिता Clear. Now in this grid, start putting up cross or tick or whatever information you have. Mr. Black is a bachelor. Mr. White is twenty-two years old. Manager, ma assistant manager is manager's grandson. That means assistant manager is male, and manager is married. it is all indian relationship assistant manager is manager's grandson that simply says that man assistant manager is male and manager is married now from manager can i delete the three unmarried people this is miss ankita miss ansho and this is mr black who is bachelor now from assistant manager can i take out the male assistant manager is male la So female, Mrs. Coffee, Ansho, and Ankita cannot be the assistant manager. Now one more thing: manager is married, and he or she have a grandson. Can twenty-two year person have a grandson? No, biologically not possible. Cross. So with this information, we have crossed this. Next information: Mr. Kelly is manager's neighbor. that means mr kelly is not the manager so mr kelly omit the manager you can see that at the end you would be left with only one box empty in one row or in one column 
Once you see that, put a tick there. If you put tick here, you cross out everything for coffee. Yes or no? Because if coffee is manager, she can't be anything else. Next information is cashier is stenographer's son-in-law. Cashier is married. And a stenographer son-in-law. That means cashier is male. Stenographer is also married. So one by one, let's delete something. Cashier is married. I'm taking out all bachelors from it. Stenographer is married. I'm taking out bachelors from it. Clear? Cashier is male. Obviously, all female went out. Cashier is male. And stenographer is married. Finish. What is the next one? Ankita is teller's stepsister. That means Ankita cannot be the teller. Teller is out from Ankita. You can see for Ankita one box is there. Put a tick here and put cross in this column. Now you will see that for Ansha one box is empty. Put a tick here, cross across. Now you can see for Mr. Black, one box is empty. Put a tick and cross across. Clear? Stenographer is father-in-law of someone. Stenographer cannot be of 20, 22 years old. So from a stenographer, I am crossing out Mr. White. Cashier is Mr. White. Stenographer is K. Mr. White is the cashier. Mr. Black is assistant manager. Mrs. Coffee is manager. Kelly is stenographer. Ansha is teller. And Ankita is the clerk. The best way to solve these kind of questions. This is only restricted to two variables. Suppose we have got three variables. They can give you name. They can give you color of the dress they are wearing. Or they can give you the city from there they are. There we can have three variables. In this case, it becomes a bit complicated. Why? How many two into two grid we can have? If there are three variables, how many two into two grid we can have? Three C2. That is three grid. Name versus color. Name versus city. And color versus city. You can have three combination. Na? So in that case, we always suggest you to make this kind of grid. Suppose these are names, this is color, this is city, and this is also city. So we have name versus color, name versus city, and color versus city. Clear? Fine? If they want to still complicate more, they can give you four variables. And now you have to identify ways out to solve these. But for as far as company uh, specific Things are concerned, company with aptitude test, maximum they will give you three, three by three, three variables, which you should set up like this. Put in the information, whatever is given. With one set of information, try to put in whatever cross or whatever tick you can. And then eventually you will see that you will get that. Had I put in any effort to find any tick here? No. Just put whatever you have. Obviously, you will get some. Unless and until data is insufficient. If you are not able to find anything, you are, suppose you are fixed between something like this. You don't know. You have got no information about these now. Suppose Ankita is tell us stepsister. That information is not given. If that information is not given, Eventually, you won't be able to fill up these. In that case, data become insufficient as far as the relationship between Anshua and Ankita is concerned. That time, you can mark that data is insufficient or more data is required, blah, blah. Clear? Good. Let's take the next one. 